single day. 22 Americans die while waiting for a transplant. The solution? Grow custom organs inside an animal host. A chimera. Will you be ordering a kidney or a heart from a human pig hybrid on Amazon this time next year? Hello, how are your kidneys doing? This is Catherine. Welcome to Double O Kidney. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications. Chimeras are coming. When people die every day, there's a problem that must be solved. Politicians are trying to solve this problem with an opt-out organ donation system. It will be in place in Europe starting from the next year. In the meanwhile, scientists are going a totally different road. Transplantable organs grown inside a human-pig hybrid. Are these chimeras the key to produce life-saving lab-grown organs? Thanks to the miracle of genetic manipulation, they could be. As soon as scientists will be able to fully grow a human kidney or a heart inside a human-pig hybrid, the organ shortage will be history. And right now, there's more hope than ever. Thanks to some recent developments, chimeras could become reality a lot sooner than people expect. But what is chimera? During the times of the ancient Greece, a chimera was this mythological lion with the head of a goat arising from its back and a tail ending with a snake's head. Today, what scientists are trying to accomplish are not these fire-breathing monsters. In medical world, a chimera is a living organism originated from the cells of two or more different organisms. Scientists have already created chimera embryos. A team led by the Salk Institute has already proven that human cells can thrive in a non-human organism. A pig, to be more specific. This team is using non-federal funding since the U.S. National Institutes of Health, NIH, decided not to fund works on chimeras. They think this is too controversial. More on this in a moment. Why chimeras can be the answer to organ shortage? Another team at the University of Texas Medical Branch at Galveston has gone even farther. They have bioengineered functioning lungs. Then they transplanted these lungs into a pig. In five years, they say, growing organs inside chimeras could be start solving the human organ shortage. So, maybe you cannot find organs on Amazon right now, but what about the next decade? The Controversy the creation in a lab of human-animal hybrid has sparked several controversy. Most are worried that the human DNA could boost the animal's intelligence, or even create sperm or eggs and make the chimera fertile. In 2015, the NIH, the U.S. National Institutes of Health, decided to suspend all the funding for studies on chimeras due to the moral issue. Chimeras are a mix between human DNA and DNA from some animal. 
while scientists' aim is to isolate only certain organs to express human genetic material, the whole chimera will comprise some human genetic material. Today, all chimeras are destroyed as embryos. When we will start harvesting organs, we will need to take them from fully grown organism. And what about the moral status? This organism will contain human DNA. Will it be our right to kill them to harvest organs? Will they have the right to continued existence? When the human-pig hybrids will be fully grown, will they have the cognitive abilities of a normal pig or will their brain evolve due to the presence of the human DNA? How should we check for the functionality of its brain? What will make the difference between an animal that can be harvested for organs at our commodity and a human-like creature with a right to live? Leave a comment and tell me what you think about this issue. This is all for today. Subscribe to this channel and turn on notifications to stay updated. Thank you for watching.